Okay, be able to identify the following terms, purgatory, monophysite, Nestorian, monothelite, duothelite, icons, hegira, Quran, hadith, jihad, shiite, sunni, feudalism, and feudal church. Purgatory is a place of purification for those who die in sin. That's purgatory. Monophysite is the Christological position called monophysitism. Physitism uh, asserted that in the person of Jesus Christ there was only one divine nature rather than two natures, divine and human, as asserted in the uh, Council of Chalcedon in 451. So monophysite, monophysite is this position that there is only one divine nature. Nestorian. Nestorianism is a Christological doctrine that emphasizes the disunion between human and divine natures of Jesus. It was advanced by Nestorius, 386-450, who is the patriarch of Constantinople, uh, influenced by Nestorius' studies under Theodore of Mosuistia at the School of Antioch. Monothelite, uh, one will, that Jesus only had one will, and the duothelite means two natures, means two wills. Right. Icons is generally a flat panel painting depicting Jesus, Mary, saints, angels, which is venerated among Eastern Orthodox, Oriental Orthodox, and in certain Eastern Catholic churches. Hajira, an Arabic word meaning immigration or flight, used to refer to any flight from danger, but especially the flight of Muhammad from Mecca to Medina in 622. The Quran, revelations of Allah to Muhammad over a 20-year period. Abu Bakr, Muhammad's successor, ordered revelations and oral traditions to be preserved, written in Arabic, the true language of Allah. Quran teaches one God, Allah, and the final revelation of his will, which completes the work of the prophets. Hadith, more practical instructions. The most orthodox hadith were compiled by al-Bukhari and Muslim. Uh, about 13,000 hadith, 3,000 shared in common by al-Bukhari and Muslim. Jihad, literally an exertion or effort. In broad sense, it was considered the sixth pillar. Inner aspect, exertion for piety. Outer aspect, submission of community to pattern of Medina. In narrow sense, a holy war, armed struggle to advance Islam. Uh, Shiite means person-centered. Religious leaders must be descendants of Muhammad and worthy. Followed Ali, Muhammad's son-in-law, who married Muhammad's daughter Fatima. Sunni is an Arab tradition-centered. Emphasized Quran and the tradition or the Sunnah of the Prophet found in the Hadith, which are sayings attributed to Muhammad. Followed successors to Abu Bakr, Muhammad's father-in-law. Feudalism arose after collapse of the Carolingian empire because of lack of protection, arose in France, transmitted to England, developed in Germany, lasted from 9th to 14th century, system of government in absence of a centralized authority, power and wealth depended on property or land, private exercise of government by nobles over vassals through granting of property in return for service, personal element, lordship of one nobleman over a vassal, investiture, vassal, investiture is that the vassal received the land from the lord, from lord, Homage, vassal promised loyalty. Liege, homage, vassal could have multiple lords but gave priority to first lord. Property, vassal received property from lord. Benefice, land loan in exchange for dues or services. Uh, government, private exercise of governmental functions over vassals and their property. And the feudal church. Churchmen became subject to secular power. Many bishoprics and abbeys came under secular appointment. Many churchmen became vassals and secular of secular lords. Mixture of religious and secular. Secular lords influenced affairs of church. Religious vassal was required to provide armies. Church came into vast holdings through vassalage. Church became more powerful and centralized. Two chains of command developed for clergy. Religious vassal owed, owed loyalties to secular lords as well as to ecclesiastical superiors led to clash between church and state. Church became more powerful and centralized. Uh, Pope became independent of Italian nobility. Religious vassals appealed to Rome for relief from domination by secular lords. Church used vast properties and dependence of secular lords upon religious vassals to exert pressure on these lords. Okay, so these were those terms. Purgatory, monophysite, Nestorian, monothelite, duothelite, icons, hegira, Quran, hadith, jihad, shiat, sunni, feudalism, and feudal church.